we all think we're in control of ourselves, what we choose to do, but more often than we realize, it's the sights, the sounds, and the smells that surround us that are in fact driving uh, our behavior and our choices instead. And our experience is derived from the integration of the senses. While we find many people talking about too much noise, too many alerts, too much information, it's hard to find anybody out there who's complaining that they didn't have enough smells today, or didn't have enough touch, or even enough taste. And so what I think we're really facing in contemporary society is really a sensory imbalance rather than sensory overload. And then think, are there sort of sense hacks that we could introduce in order to make uh, the environment more comfortable um, for different individuals? My name is Professor Charles Spence. 